Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Here is part 2 of SAP FI training. As you all know, I am releasing a series of videos on SAP and I am doing an exclusive SAP FI training right from the basics to advanced learning. In the previous video, we had an elaborate discussion on the SAP FI organizational units. For today's discussion, we will see in detail about client in SAP and also have a demo of how to configure client in SAP. For those who have missed on my previous video, I shall leave the link to it at the end of this video. Also please check in the description box. You could also alternatively access all the videos from the playlist in my channel. Now let's get started with today's topic. Here is a quick recap of client. Client is the highest level in SAP organizational hierarchy. It is an independent organizational unit with its own set of master records and set of tables. Definition of SAP client is mandatory. The specification you make at the client level are valid for all organizational units below the client. This ensures that data is entered only once, thus eliminating duplication, reducing redundancies and saving resources like storage space. When you install the SAP system, the following clients are available which are delivered by SAP. Client 000 also called as SAP reference client. Client 001 also called as production preparation client. Client 066 also called as early watch client. SAP reference client 000 contains the following settings. All the SAP tables with default values are delivered in Client 000. Company code 0001 contains complete customizing. This comes delivered in SAP Reference Client 000. Country specific customizing, that is, legal and business requirements of all standard countries, is delivered in company code templates XX01, where XX stands for the country indicator. And SAP updates the settings in client 000 for each new release. As a result, client 000 always has the current status. Client 001, also called production preparation client, is identical to SAP reference client. Whenever there is an upgrade happening for client 000, the entries or the changes which are put in client 000 are copied to client 001 using release customizing. So this client 001 is copied into your test environment that is development sandbox and later on customized in development client to suit your business requirement. Just like your SAP reference client 000, production preparation client 001 also should not be used for production processing. Client 066 is also called as early watch client. This client is exclusively for SAP to remotely log on to the system and fix any issues. Beginners would still have a doubt whether client denotes customers or organizational units or any other technical entity. As defined in the enterprise structure, 
it means the organization for which sap is being configured for example sap is configured for indian oil corporation or big bazaar or tata steel in these cases these companies are clients however when defined in basis terms that is the sap technical system client means the different installations of sap used for varied purposes let's see in the next few slides and understand this in detail in any sap project there has to be minimum 3 environments the development environment the quality assurance or testing environment and the production environment within each environment there are different clients that are used for specified purposes like under the development client you can have three clients under the quality assurance client here we are seeing three clients and the production client has got one client under development client you need one for configuration the other one sandbox the other one is for unit testing under the quality assurance we have got one for quality assurance testing one for training and the other one for training for a different purpose and so on of course under production we have one client now we will see each one of this in detail in the next few slides in a standard sap settings development environment would have three clients one is a configuration or development client the other one is sandbox and the third one is a development testing client usually the initial design for a new implementation project or any new process is first done in a sandbox once you are satisfied that the configuration is shaping up as desired we move it to the development client where the new configuration for the project are fully created and from this is where the transports happens to other clients development client is also called golden client only the design part is done here and no testing or transaction processing are allowed in development client in development testing client unit testing is conducted once the configuration has been successfully tested it is now ready to move to the quality and assurance environment quality assurance client is where all final testings are conducted prior to moving transports to the production environment normally this is where end to end business process testings and user acceptance testings are conducted there is a minimum of one quality assurance client that is used to conduct testing you may parallelly have few more clients under quality assurance environment for various other purposes like training data conversion and user sandboxes once the entire project solution has been tested successfully in quality assurance client it is now ready to move to production production environment is where all day to day business activities occur this is the client that all end users use to perform their daily job functions there is usually only one production client per sap installation let's look at the demo for defining client in sap on the sap easy access screen navigate to tools administration administration client administration client maintenance or alternatively 
you could just use the decode SCCR in the command field. Press enter. In the screen that appears, click on display change button. Press continue when the information window pops up. Click on new entries button. Fill in the details as shown here. The client, the client key, client description, the city and the other details as shown in this slide and this next slide. Once you enter the details, click on save button. Click on the back button. Here is the client you just created. My sincere suggestion would be to please remember the menu path, T code and table names. This is very important as far as your interviews are concerned and also when you get onto the floor and start working independently, you need to know all these. In my next video, we will be discussing in detail about company and the definition of company. Stay tuned in. Hope you found this video really interesting. If yes, please give it a big thumbs up. Only then I would understand that you are liking my contents and that would keep me motivated to post more contents. Please share it among your friends. And for those who are new to my channel, please consider subscribing to my channel where I post all interesting videos on SAP. Here is the link for my previous video. Have a look. Thanks so much for watching.